This program was paid for by Water of Life Church. From Water of Life Ministries in Plano, Texas, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob is speaking through his servants to the world. He that hath ears to hear, let him hear what the Spirit of the Lord is saying today. Let us join Doyle Davidson and others of Water of Life, sowing the Word of God in spirit and in truth. Hello, I'm Doyle Davidson, servant and apostle of the Lord Jesus Christ. <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> to break in <laughs> Jeremiah was a bullfrog. <laughs> um, hello, I'm Don Davidson. My goodness. Maybe you need to read it to him. <laughs> hello, I'm Don Davidson. This is locally to the body of Christ in Dallas Fort Worth, Texas, and said by God to your house to declare unto you the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ. First Corinthians 15, 3 and 4, tell us what the gospel is. How that Jesus Christ died for our sins according to the scripture. He was buried and he rose again the third day according to the scripture. Amen. Spare the Lord upon me because he's anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor, send me to heal the brokenhearted, preach deliverance to the captives, recovering of sight to the blind, and set at liberty to them that are bruised. The word is not the even in your heart and your mouth. There's a word of faith which I preach. <laughs> People confess with their mouth the Lord Jesus and believe in his heart, in your heart, that God has raised him from the dead. <laughs> you shall be saved with the heart, man, believe it unto righteousness. With the mouth, confession is made unto salvation. <clears throat> I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Christ and it's the power of God. Of the salvation, everyone that believeth, to the Jew first and also to the Greek therein, is the righteousness of God revealed from faith to faith, as it is written, the just shall live by his faith. Amen. <clears throat> I want to welcome everyone receiving this broadcast on live stream. Thank God for Roku, Apple TV, YouTube, or other devices. Thank God. Amen. Thank God. Amen. Hallelujah. On my right. In this corner. Go. <laughs> Go, host. Jerry Brown, good morning. Good morning. Thank you. I don't sound like Doyle Davidson, but I'm a fill in. Amen. <laughs> And to my left, co-host, uh, Kathy Davidson, good morning. Good morning. And then, did you say good morning? I said good morning. Okay, thanks. <laughs> and then, to your left, uh, Apostle, amen, co-host, Kathy Reese, good morning. Good morning. Hallelujah. And then in Colorado, on the wire, Kathy Courier, good morning. Good morning. Wonderful. They are to talk, but they're not going to do much at all. Maybe two hours. Amen. Is it time for bringing my girls out? Amen. That's good. Let's have them. By the
two o'clock. I didn't even have a voice. I could get hard to get a word up. They finally started coming. And I made it through yesterday pretty well. And I wanted to sleep last night. And I did. I went to sleep. I woke up sometime. I don't know what time. But I couldn't get much out of it. Many words with any volume. I could hear them, but I couldn't get a lot of volume. And later this morning, I kept praying. They didn't sound good. These don't either. This doesn't even sound like me. But uh, in the office here, I sneeze out three spirits. <laughs> and after they went out I could talk different Amen. but there's a story that I've been fighting for I told KB something about a building in Los Angeles something that was in my heart and it seemed right, and it may be. It may be. But there's a building in L.A. that's ours. That meeting one of my church in Los Angeles. And I happen to be the third director. And I'm only going to be there in case the devil shows up. Well, after all, he uh, stood by my pillow at three in the morning. I woke up and I thought, who is this? There's the devil. So he doesn't scare me much anymore. But there's a building in Los Angeles where Water Black Church of Los Angeles Amen. <clears throat> Ted Ross, the director. Amen. God will bring Ted face to face with that building. And I'm going to tell you something. Before I followed God, I wasn't sure of a lot of things. But when I saw him, my veterinary hospital in McKinney. I was living in Missouri. I went there, and there was a house, the only house in town. And the rent was $50 a month. And the man knew me real well. He said, well, I'm going to shave it even rent it to you. I said, look, it's only the only house in town I got. I need it. Well, that house was a good place. Good place for growing up in the spirit. I had my first home Bible study in that house. Amen. And then we go to Florida. And there's a house. Star shape. I've never seen one like it. On just on Hollywood Boulevard <clears throat> in Hollywood, Florida. And then we go back to Texas. And here's six and a half acres. Just where God wanted us to be, Argyle. And I'd sold a farm, had enough money to make a substantial payment on that six and a half figures and the house it's just what we needed when I went back to McKinney God told me where the office was you can read about it what it would cost the whole business Amen. that's the way it was Amen. then there was a house that God wanted us to have and I tried to buy 
one in Pagani, and while the while the uh, British thing agent was showing me the house, somebody went to his office and bought it. <laughs> and I said, well, obviously that's not our house. And Patty said, well, no, you know, I've been looking out in Maryview. I said, I know. Let's go. I went to Maryview. She said, her and Kathy said, I like that house right there on the corner, right on Highway 5. I said, well, let's go in. Opened the door, and some guy walked in the back door and said, this is your house. I said, and who are you? He said, my wife is a realtor, and this is your house. It was. God worked it out. The man that owned it was in Iran. He was a lieutenant colonel in the Marine Corps. Lived in it for six weeks, I think it was. Anyway, when we came to Plano, this building was for sale. Church of Christ, Pittman Creek Church, Church of Christ. And six different people, groups, had tried to buy it. Two of them had the money. And God told them, no, you don't buy it. God ran them off. So I show up, and it's almost to us. Well, Ted Ross is in Los Angeles. And you better know, there's a building there that belongs to Ted, the director, and the rest of them that are with him. And I'm there just to help them get going and keep going. And in case the devil wants to play around, we'll talk to him. But after all, that's not the, the easiest thing you'll do is establish something because Satan doesn't want you to. Anyway, <clears throat> good night. My hand's stinging. <clears throat> anyway, um, it'll be great. Oh, by the way, the money will be available to pay cash. We we don't we don't like payments now and then. Amen. No, if God owns all the silver and all the gold and all the cattle on earth, thou's in Him and owns the world and people that live in it and everything else, He can sure pay for a church building. Amen. Would you agree? Amen. Okay, that's the way I think. I read 50, Psalm 50 before I went into the ministry. And it said, the Lord said, if I were hungry, I wouldn't ask you or tell you or something like that. And I said, well, okay. If you wouldn't tell me if you were hungry, Expect me to ask your people for money. Amen. And I have it. And I took up one offering where he told me it was his offering. And two or three times I've told people, you need to send this amount of money in. And one did and two never did. I wonder what will happen to those two that never did. You follow me? What do we do, folks? What's next? You ready to worship and praise God? Do what? Worship and praise God. Are we ready for Jerry Mine? What are my boys? Amen. Let's get ready. Hallelujah, can you say hallelujah again? Hallelujah. <laughs> praise, praise.
You're a love, you're a 
it was dark in my heart. You brought light to me, a child of darkness became a child of light.
Baby. 
you to visit Water of Life Church at 1621 18th Street in Plano, Texas. Or for further information, call area code 972-578-8082. That's 972-578-8082. Or write Doyle Davidson, Post Office Box 861327, Plano, Texas 75086. 
That's Doyle Davidson, Post Office Box 861327, Plano, Texas 75086. This program was paid for by Water of Life Church.